I am so excited for today's haul because I've been waiting to do this since my very first Temu haul, but that's what we're gonna get into today. I have a box. I mean, this box is so heavy. There's so many goodies in here to share with you today. And I just feel so lucky because today's video is sponsored by Temu. And I just, I'm so grateful for that. So thank you so much. I'm going to have some amazing codes for this video to share with you guys. So don't forget to save this video and definitely grab your codes before you hop over to Temu and check out because they are doing a crazy massive sale on Valentine's Day, which is 90% off. 90, percent off. Percent off. Plus, you can add my code as well, which you're going to get an additional 30% off, which I will have a link that will take you straight to Temu that will include the 30% off, or you can use my code. So you're going to get 90% off on Valentine's Day. You're going to get the extra 30% off of just anything that you put in your cart with my code. And you're also going to get free shipping, which is so amazing. So thank you so much to Temu for sponsoring today's video. Now, these items items today I actually these I purchased myself so if you watch my very first Temu haul I wanted them to surprise me so it was my very first time on this website and I just kind of wanted them to send me um, what they liked and that's what they did and then I did like a surprise unboxing with you guys now these items for today I actually ordered myself I paid for these myself and I just had to go down the rabbit hole of of all these goodies now these are all like crafty stickers so let's just let's dive in because there's a lot the first item that i actually got is this little tool right here it's kind of like a two-in-one and it has on one side it has this like ink blotter but this is made specifically for when you receive packages in the mail and you want to remove your address or any information from the packaging um so love that feature and then it also has a little cutting tool so you can just like open up your packages all right next up I picked up, and by the way, this is also like me unboxing this for the first time. I did clearly open the box and I could kind of see what was on top, but this is also a surprise to me. Um, so actually, let's use that. I'm gonna just demonstrate right here, kind of like what I'm talking about. So here's a little label, and then look at that. It's gone. I don't, I don't, I don't know what sorcery this is, but there you go and i'm i'm pretty sure this comes in multiple colors as well so this just looks like um vintage paper and i'm so excited because it looks so pretty and so unique i think in the link it's kind of like for wrap sandwiches like you can actually use this with food because it's wax paper but i do fully intend to use this for junk journaling. I think this is just such a gem of a find. And just so that you can see like all of the cute little prints, I can definitely cut this down to size in my journal. And yeah, I love wax paper as um, like material for junk journaling. Okay, next up looks like I got um, kind of like a file folder and also like a clipboard in one, I think. Um, and they also have these in multiple colors. I think I wanted to use this kind of for my book log. So look how cool that is. I don't know which, which way is up or down, but you've got a snap clip right here. And then you also have a snap clip on the side. I will throw a picture so you guys can see like what it looks like on the website. And I love how it also has this clear plastic on the edge so that if you need to do any sort of organization, you'll be able to like properly fit a label down in there. Okay, next up is this right here. You can see it's got like a little yellow check. This is also, I think, 
labeled on their website for like food which i think is really awesome too so if you wanted to do like some type of picnic you could find really great things on their website but you can see it kind of has like a wax part on that side and then it's kind of more of a flat here but yeah it's like to basically wrap food or hot dogs so cute especially if you're going to do maybe some type of like baby shower and you're doing a theme these would be cute for like the food setup area but i did get all of this for junk journaling i just thought it was so pretty and i really liked the yellow it is another wax um like paper but this one has a really cute print look how many you get in here by the way for the price which i'm throwing up like the prices as i go here um but it's it's just wild it's like the website of my dreams I mean, the little strawberries are so freaking pretty. Then I got a bunch of these cute little pens. You guys know if you watch me, like with Dollar Tree, I'm obsessed with like finding novelty pens. And I found these adorable like astronaut galaxy pens. Like what? And the astronauts are all kind of holding something different. So let me just kind of give you guys an up close shot of them. These are pens and that's just absolutely adorable. That's the other thing too, like if you ever do anything with like a theme, whether it's a party or a movie night thing, you know, like let's say you're into The Bachelor and like it's your thing to throw a bachelor party and you could find a lot of great like decor and stuff. Like this one has the little rocket ship, this ink roller. So this is also like a male cover-up, whereas that one specifically made for thermal packages. Um, this one could be kind of anything for like, you know, basic letters that you get in the mail with your address. Yeah, you just have like this little roller and it's just gonna like automatically cancel out, you know, kind of like that thing. While we're here, this is actually so, I was blown away that I found this on Temu. So the backstory on this is that one of my guilty pleasures that I watch on YouTube are accounts where they build like miniature things in miniature houses. And they always have like boxes that look like this where it comes with everything and the instructions. And I'm just like, where do they get that from? And lo and behold, I found it on Temu. So this is a, a coffee shop and it's kind of like an adult version of Legos. It's like Legos and a puzzle kind of combined in one. And I think this is so cute. I think it's gonna be such a fun hobby for me to do. So I got this cute little coffee shop and then I also got, what is this, a farmhouse? I got a little farm, you guys. I mean, you can hear all of the little pieces and you can see just all of the little details that come in here. And I think this is such a fun idea. I love when they do kids things, but like an adult version, like adult coloring books and adult puzzles, adult games, video games. Um, now we kind of have like an adult's version of Legos and this is so cute. I was definitely on a wax paper kick. <laughs> So if any of you are on a journaling kick with me, junk journaling, wax paper is great. It kind of gives this like vintage feel and I really love this red stripes. Plus the price is just there. It's just so good that I was just like, you know what, for a couple of bucks, yeah. So I got that. Then I also found it in, I definitely was looking for like cute prints. Um, so with, Valentine's Day in mind, I found it in these little heart prints. But like, how sweet is that also? You know, like if you're not into junk drilling, but you love kind of getting in the mood of the holidays and just in the spirit of things, this would be cute to maybe like pack your kids lunch with, you know, wrap their sandwich with it. And that would just be really fun. And then I found the, this floral print. Like I'm so excited for this one. Pencil pouch. I was definitely thinking of um, just, you know, planner, accessories, all, all that kind of stuff when I was shopping this time. I wanted this video to have a very specific theme, so this is very much planner-driven, junk journal-driven. Let's see what's next. 
All right, I remember this. This is so cute. Um, it's a little mini photo album. I feel like, yeah, it's the one where like, if you have the, that prints the photos like this, what's that called? I don't know what that's called. Micah has one of those little cameras, but this little album is meant for that. And I just thought the album itself was so cute. They have multiple options to choose from. Like look how clean this is. And it just looks so retro. And that's why I had to go for it. It says my film. And then it kind of has like film style printing. And then on the back it says say cheese. That's so cute. I got this for Micah, so I'm gonna um, put this in her Valentine's Day gift basket because she does a lot of, um, she takes a lot of like pictures with that those style of cameras, like with her and her friends. Look at this sticker. It is a curtain, like, and I, like that is a thick sticker. It's the quality. I am blown away. This is also kind of giving Pride and Prejudice. Like, this is what I imagine, um, you know, Elizabeth Bennett is looking out the window of her mansion because she snagged Mr. Darcy. They had multiple colors of these little windows. So I got the green curtain set. You guys, this will all be linked down below for you. Um, just to make it as easy as possible. I think I got blue as well. I feel like I got every color option that they had. But the fact that they are giving us like so many options is really cool. Some of them kind of have it like, but they are a big sticker. But the blue one's probably going to be my favorite. This is the one. Yeah. Yeah. Blue's my like favorite color, so. Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. I'm shook. Okay, next up we've got a little like business card wallet. So what did I order this for? Ooh, that is so pretty. Okay, I remember this. Um, yeah, I've been, by the way, I've been adding stuff to my cart for so long um, that some of the stuff I've, I've forgotten that I even like added in the first place, but this is so cute. I think I definitely got this um, to do something with like my junk journals. I don't know if I was gonna like organize little miniature stickers or something in here. All right, next up, I got these little bow ties. And what I thought was so unique about them was the fact that they have like the twisty tie attached to it. So it's made essentially for like treat bags and party bags so you can like zip seal tight you know a, a cellophane bag essentially um but i i looked at them and i thought i can definitely work with this from a junk journaling perspective so here's what it looks like and then it's just kind of like fed through the back of the bow so then yeah you can just bend it i mean all of these colors in here look how many you get that's just crazy. Here's another pen. Now this one, very similar to the other one where it's kind of has this like all white moment, but it has a cute little red heart at the top. Um, this is just really pretty. I also got some jewelry. Now there is going to be a another theme with a Temu coming soon where I'm gonna do all jewelry and clothing and purses cause they have it all. So, but on this one trip, I guess I just couldn't wait to get these little earrings, but please. How sweet is that? And you'll never guess like the price. I know that it was cheap, so I'm throwing up the prices here, but that's super cute. Also, just FYI, from a junk journaling perspective, you can definitely work with jewelry. Some of my favorite people that I watch on YouTube use jewelry and they create charms and all kinds of stuff. I did get, I guess, several packages of these. And these are gonna be filled with a bunch of stickers. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and start inserting clips so that you can see each one by one. Now each package is different, has a different theme that I chose. So the first one that I'm gonna open um, has like a vintage coffee theme and it has 200 pieces in here. 
and you guys this is absolutely stunning like the packaging itself also keep the packaging because you can journal with that too by the way so um if you watch me junk journal in december with my christmas journal then you then you know that i used a bunch of packaging but this is so pretty and it was exactly what i was hoping for i really wanted papers that looked vintage the next one has like a floral theme um but yeah also all the vintage vibes in here as well the packaging again just 10 out of 10 so absolutely stunning i love oh this one has like butterflies and just a woodsy woodland yeah there's like deer there's mushrooms Ooh, this one's so pretty and some of them kind of have like that burnt paper look the third one is called handwritten letter so it probably has that like yeah 1800s vibes to it which sometimes i'm like was i really born in the right generation because i really think i would have rocked it in the 1800s for real like let me live by candlelight well i mean but no ac hmm. maybe maybe not maybe not i i'm probably where, exactly where i need to be okay this one is gorgeous yeah you're definitely getting handwritten letters i'm seeing glasses and next up um looks like i got something that is related to Alice in Wonderland. I also went down the rabbit hole, no pun intended. Um, I wanted to see what I could find from a Alice in Wonderland perspective because that's gonna be my next junk journal I wanna do. But oh my gosh, they're like vintage postcards and they are so pretty. wow i have to i have to order another set of these i love when they do just like you know it just kind of looks like the old school ads then i got these cute little journals these little images they just get me like and there's a bunch of this little girl i don't know what she's called to be honest i'm sure she has a name but look at her and her little witch's hat and then it has these cute little tabs and it's just a little journal. Like this is what I wish we could get from, you know, like Dollar Tree and places like that. I mean, this is why I think it makes Temu so special because that is just absolutely precious. And I feel like I bought, yeah, here's another one. I was gonna say, I could have sworn that I got another journal. So here she is again. Um, this one has more of a pink solid color to it and it's just a journal but it has little like sections to it so cute so we got the purple and the pink tell me that's not like the cutest thing i'm probably gonna let my niece play with one of those um okay next up looks like i got little mini cellophane bags i think that's what this is so let's just open it up let me just grab one. Oh yeah so they're little clear bags, the little pocket, and then they even have like the sticker seal. These are great for journaling. Next up, I found this little paper pad. Has a little floral theme to it. So let's just, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, I thought it was. I love looking for paper packs like this. So pretty. Like I got a little um, washi masking set, but obviously you can see that it's not very like traditional washi with the round style. This is more like sheets of washi, right? But it's actually like washi strips and it's hard to tell, but they have these like little slits in them. So you can just kind of see. How cool is that? Like that's a really cool, unique way to to package washi i guess so i really liked that okay next up we're gonna look into some of these stickers so this one just looks like a bunch of books and then food 
So super cute. Um, I love anything that kind of has like library-ish. Um, yeah, that just kind of looks like a bunch of cute little books. And especially, you know what? If you're not into junk journaling, if, but if you want to try bullet journaling, I'm telling you stickers would be a great option if you feel like you can't draw, but you're still very intrigued by bullet journaling. Cause that was like one of my things. I mean, I still try to bullet journal here and there. Um, stickers is a great, great way to use it, but yeah, super cute stickers. There was another color. I guess there was yellow. So I feel pretty confident I got every color, but I'm, I'm going to double check again and see if they had like pink curtains, but looks like we got yellow, blue, purple, red, and green. So I'll insert a clip here so you can kind of like see all of the curtain colors together, but I wish you guys could reach through the screen and feel the quality of this. Like it's, it's insane. Like I love it. All right, next up, I hauled these cute little dolls. I don't know what they're called, but they kind of like remind me of Sailor Moon. Um, but they are so cute. And then I got the blue set, the green set, and the brown set. So I'll go ahead and insert some up close shots here so you can see what some of these dolls look like. But they're just so cute. They're just darling. Their little outfits are really cute too. And they're wearing bows. So yeah, got those. All right, next up are some more stickers. Now I love these. These are a little bit larger. Um, I think this one has like a little coffee theme to it. Um, so, and the price really, it's just the price is what's really going to um, put you in a chokehold with this website because it's just, it's just unbeatable, honestly. So we've got those and then this next one it just looks like i don't know it's just kind of like random ish but let me just see we're getting some cute little bucket hats and floral prints yeah there's just some bicycles and keys it's really cute it's like a really has kind of like a boho chic style to these to this little set so i got that um, looks like I did pick up some traditional washies. Now these are really beautiful because they kind of have like a border-ish style to them. I mean, that's what like washi really is, right? It's like a border, but um, so pretty. So I got this one and I'm sure I'm gonna just insert a clip so you guys can kind of like see it on paper and see what it just looks like because it's kind of hard to see when they're rolled up but i got this little green set and then the blue set it kind of in a way reminds me of like icing on a cake so i think those are really cute and sweet here is this next set of little vintage stickers they're like little strawberries and they kind of look like stamps so i think that's really really cute so i'll insert a clip here so you guys can see those up close as well looks like yeah there there's so many little stamps in this one now this is a really cute set so um i would i would shop this little this little set here some more stickers packaged the same way so i'll insert clips here so you can see what all of those look like um i really like the size of them they're so pretty and like i said i shop in so many different places for stickers like this and a lot of them, they're just like the same. Um, but these are definitely very unique. I think they're just like pretty exclusive um, to their website. So, so pretty. Absolutely love those. Then I got these little sticker packs, which I think has like a vintage look to it. Um, I'm seeing, oh, you know what? This was actually a Christmas pack, but I decided to grab it anyways because I didn't want to miss out on it. So I'll just like put it away with my stuff for Christmas. But there was just something so sweet about this blue and brown theme with this that I just, I didn't want to miss out on it. I figured I would probably forget by next Christmas and because I didn't want to forget, I just decided to order it now, which is also a cool thing. I love that you can still like shop Christmas stuff, you know? All right, next up are these little um, 
cards so i'm dying to open into them so i got these two little boxes one has the cute little teddy bear i'm pretty sure that inside this box is going to be stickers as well so let's just see also keep the box because they're great for journaling with too so oh i remember this now yeah they're just really large stickers like how cute is that set which i'm pretty sure that's like that that's the color theme and they had more to choose from as well so they didn't just have the blue and they didn't just have this like black and white but those are the two that i definitely wanted to go for this one's really cute <laughs> there's just food and chocolate um while sticking to the black and white theme there's little like hearts and cow stuff and diamonds yeah it definitely reminds me of visco next up i actually don't know what this is but i think they're little oh that is so look how small those little cellophane bags are that is really cute i wasn't really sure what size they were going to be you get quite a bit in here but i'm also going to junk journal with these but like let's say you're an etsy seller and you sell little jewelries or handmade bracelets or little rings temu is a great place to go get your packaging for your business are these little paper packs and they're so cute very vintage um so i'll go ahead and insert a clip here so you can see that but yeah, they're just little, they're just little random bits of pieces of vintage paper. Um, I love this one with the pa with the actual paper look to it, with the grid lines and everything. I actually have needed something like that in my collection, so I'm very excited for that. I'm probably gonna have to place another order to get another set of those. Um, but yeah, so a lot of tags and labels and stickers with this. Super cute. One is like a cottage garden theme. And that is it for my Temu haul today. Don't forget to check out the description box below. It's going to give everything that you're going to need to capitalize on all of these deals and sales. So don't forget that Valentine's Day is 90% off right now. And they have really great Valentine's Day decor. That's actually going to be my next haul. You're going to see all things Valentine from Temu. So I'm super excited. Then again, like I said, we're going to get into like jewelry and clothing and purses so i'm definitely gonna be doing themes if there's another theme that you definitely want to see from me from them comment down below like do you want to see home gadgets kitchen appliances because this website like i said it has it all but don't forget when you go to shop um to use my code at checkout for 30 percent off on your order so um, there's gonna be a link that will take you to that or you can use my code when you go to checkout and you're also gonna get free shipping so how amazing is that they're gonna give you amazing things at prices that just like will literally blow your mind and they just they have so many of the cutest most unique things so i hope you guys enjoyed this haul if you did please give it a big thumbs up and thank you once again to temu for sponsoring me i can't believe they sponsored me a second time i'm so appreciative and i love working with them by the way they are the sweetest people ever so that's it for today i'll see you guys next time bye